What's up, everybody? Saran Neal, I'm 33 from Buffalo Bills. I guess y'all wondering why I'm here, you know? We got Black on Restaurant Week coming up next week. And uh, I chose Parkview. And the reason I chose Parkview is because, you know, I'm from the South and I'm from a part of an area, you know, that looked like this. And you know me, I'm a country boy. If y'all don't know, I'm from Fort Gaines, Georgia. You know, on the website, I'm from Alabama, but I'm originally from Fort Gaines, Georgia. And where I'm from, you know, it's almost like this. I'm a country boy and I love soul food. And the best soul food is Parkview from Miss Arita. I mean, the first time I ate it, man, I fell in love with it. It felt like I was back home eating at the table with my brothers and sisters. So I told this place and, you know, hands down, probably one of the best soul food from scratch ever made here in Buffalo, New York. So I come here today to show y'all and show how she prepared and how we gonna prepare it together. So I hope nobody here at eight cause we gonna get a lot of eating in a day and we're gonna show how we do it, sure. Hey, we here today at Parkview. You know, I'm here with Miss Harita and her mom, Miss Williams. And I told this place because the food is unbelievable. But for right now, we about to cook up famous hoagies. Steak hoagies. Steak hoagies. And we're gonna show you how we do it. Let's get busy. This is how we do it. So we're just gonna put some oil on here because we have to get our onions going, okay? So I just come from the side, and just chop okay. them up. Ooh, they yeah. professionals at this. You see, they do a lot faster than me. I don't know if they said where y'all from, but where I'm from, they say, did you stick your feet in it? <laughs> Fofo. <-fo. laughs> so we're gonna stick your feet in them, not actually put your feet in it, but it tastes so good from the soul, man. So let's get it. Let's get it. So we're gonna season the onions. So we want the onions to have a nice flavor for them. There you go, that's yeah. perfect. And then just take a little bit of the seasoning salt and just sprinkle it on there. There you go, that's perfect. That's enough? That's enough. Yeah. At the same time, we have our noodles on. We're making our mac and cheese. cheese. So we need to get mac and cheese is the bomb. These are noodles for the, the elbow noodles for the mac and cheese. Can't have the soul food without the mac and cheese. You're doing a great job. <laughs> You're a natural. So that right there, one pack, one will make about one hoagie. So I'm gonna do one and a half, because you guys like to eat. If meat cooks really fast, so you have to chop it really fast. The ranch is a natural. I'm a natural. I see. I'm impressed. This is the sauce right here. This is that hoagie sauce. And I'm gonna put some of this in here so I can lubricate the meat. So now we're gonna separate it so that we can make our hoagies. Oh man, y'all see this? Oh man. Some people like to leave them top too. Okay. And then you take this. Mm-hmm. And, and roll it. And you roll it. Hey. Roll it. And you roll it. Roll it and you roll it and you roll it. And then you tuck it. You're ready to eat. I hope y'all boy ready to eat. This is a specialties from Miss Harita, from your boy. Uh, you really cook it though? Yes. Really yes. It? Yes. You toast the bread though. Yes. Yes. You toast the bread? Yes. There you go. I'm gonna take you get right the grill. You know what I'm saying? Miss Harita, I don't. I don't know what the recipe is, but it hit. You like that? Yes. You like it? Well, thank you. We're going to save this for later. We got plenty more food to cook. The hoagies was valid, as you can see. And guess what? We ain't done yet. We not done yet. We can put the mac and cheese together first, because it has to go in the oven. And at the same time, while that's cooking, we'll start filling the yams to get that on and the greens and green beans. And by the time the mac and cheese is done, then everything else is ready to be ready to Hey, I'm following your footsteps. You got it. Yeah. You really cooking? Yes. All that cheese, it look like some macaroni and cheese is coming next. Yes. It's coming up. Yes. Ready? So what are we doing? What are we doing? 
What are we doing? Yes, sir. Stir it up. <laughs> this is our seasoning for the mac and cheese. Mm -hmm. You dump the whole thing That's in? That's the parkview seasoning. Dump okay. the whole thing in whole there. Whole thing in there. The whole thing in there. Sprinkle it? Sprinkle some pepper, like, just like this. There we go. First. Okay. Pour from the center. Okay. Got it? Hey. Hey. Right there? Yep. Okay, so now we have our collard greens and green beans in the pan. Gotta have the collard greens. Most definitely the green beans. Gotta have your vegetables. We have our secret seasoning for our greens and green beans. Hey. People will always ask, what do you have? Don't ask me, I don't know. We're gonna pour this in here. No. Ample? Ample. Drop it in. Drop it in. One more over here. I think I, I cut a little bit better than you because I got a little bit more muscles. I guess, I guess not. It's a technique to everything. A little elbow grease. Yep. Baby potatoes. So I just cut them in half usually. All on the green beans? All on the green beans. All on the green beans. So we're going to bring Tremaine in and we're going to show him how we made the yam. Because they have to boil down. How long? See, she moved a little bit faster than me. How long? Um, about 45 minutes. And, 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 and she not passed me. She didn't hit the track, everyone. Oh. Yum, look. Oh, my God. Boom. Go, 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 go. That's good. Keep going. One more. One more. That's how they do it. They making it happen. Yes. Hey, they, you hear what they said? They go do another job, full-time teacher, right? Okay. Then came back and still get a job done on the stove. Y'all know how mamas do it. Look at that hand work. Come on now. <laughs> it, it gotta be in you, not on you. And we're gonna cover it in flour. And drop it. The left side is for chicken. That's very good. Drop the chicken. Now we're gonna sit here and wait about 20, 25 minutes. Wait till it's done. And we're good. We're gonna be back. Another reason why I chose, you know, this restaurant. Come on. Hey, you see I called my boy, my dogs out. Main, main Jaquan. Hey, hey y'all see what they're doing back here? They back here getting it in. They back here getting it in. There ain't no way you can have the food. What are the cards? I just called D Ham. Just called um, JT. Got time. Now I call you back. You got it. Hey, what boy is that? What boy is that? No, uh, don't eat. Don't eat. Nah, uh, come to park you right now. We got to cook it up. B main park you. The soul food joint. See? And hey, look at him. Hey, bro, pull up the uh, park you. Boy, eat. It's already cooked and everything. Come on and eat it. Uh, all the boys, boys down here eat. You know we got names in the back, boys in the back. Come on, man. Come get some food. Hey, chicken wings. Look how golden them things is, man. Looks delicious. See that seasoning? Let me see that hat I took in. Oh, right here. Yeah. Come on, man. And we got a little messy in here. But what is cooking if you don't get messy? If you ain't messy, you ain't cooking. I come eat your food and you ain't got no stains on your clothes, I ain't eating it. As you can see right now, the food looks amazing. Uh, we did a great job. I'm not going to take all the credit. You know, Miss Williams, Miss Arita, and your very own friend, Neil. We did an awesome job. Catfish. Come on, man. I got my mac and cheese, I got my baked beans. I gotta have a turkey neck in both of them, of course. And I got my yams. And I don't know if I said it yet, but yeah. This is my turkey rib. So I got the dark meat, I got the wing, I got a thigh, you know, but so. We about to get real busy over here. Hey, we got our very own Jamal Hammond. The yams taste like sweet potato pie. Come on, man. It's like a whole different vibe. 
What do you taste like? Negative. Negative. Hey, and guess what? And guess where you from? Where are you, where you from? Alabama. Alabama. Okay. Come on now. Different. You in the morning? What? Different. 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 And doing, you know, preparing the food for everybody. Man, this is a wonderful time, wonderful event. And one day, hopefully, I can do it again. Guess what? We out. Thank you, guys.